Hello, my lovely people. How many of you are like me, stuck at home due to the COVID-19 situation? Last week, I celebrated my birthday and guess what? I had originally planned for a trip to beautiful Okinawa, soaking in some sun and love, but then instead I have to stay in, ordered myself a cake and then cook my own birthday dinner. But don't worry, I still enjoyed myself nonetheless. How about you? What have you been doing during this period? Are you having a good time? Or are you suffering at home? This month, our pillar of happiness is health. To me, there is a holy trinity when it comes to health, physical health, mental health, and emotional health. Each one is equally important for your overall well-being. And since we are all staying at home, I want to kickstart our health month to talk about self-care. So what is self-care? According to the dictionary, self-care is defined as the practice of taking action to preserve or improve one's own health. In another version, it says self-care is the practice of taking an active role in protecting one's own well-being and happiness, and particularly during periods of stress. In other words, if you are stressed, if you want to be happy, and if you want to improve your health, then self-care is for you. So how exactly do you self-care? If you look up self-care on Google, you will find 101 ways on which you can self-care. Today, I'm going to help you figure out, and not only that, to implement self-care routine into your day-to-day -day life. So let's get started. Firstly, I want you to know self-care is different for everyone. I have my ways of making myself feel good, and I'm sure you have your own ways of making yourself feel good. Therefore, the first thing you want to do is to write down a list of activities that you enjoy doing and categorize them under things to do daily, weekly, monthly, and yearly. For me, daily activities are things like yoga or toning in the morning, enjoying nice food, talking with my husband, and my skincare routine. As a coach, I have to bear in mind that I need to take care of myself in order for me to take care of those around me. So I like to start and end my day with some me time by staying in shape in the morning and pampering myself at night. Also eating delicious food and sharing my day with my husband also recharge me after a long day of work. Then once a week, I try to catch up with my family. I also enjoy planning my meals for the week, doing some chores, and once a month, I will meet my friends, pamper myself with facial, and my husband and I will also try and explore new places together. Of course, once or twice yearly, we will plan for overseas travel together, um, taking up new courses and stuff like that. So these are the things that I enjoy doing and they make me happy after I've done them. How about you? There are some other examples like catching up on the latest movie or drama, making coffee is one of them, learning new language, shopping, so many more. So once you've written down the things that you enjoy doing in each category, it's time to integrate them into your life. So. First thing is to schedule the yearly activities first. You can set aside time to carry out these activities. Personally, I like to plan my holiday around March because it's my birthday and also the beginning of spring. Then as for the monthly activities, I schedule them onto my calendar and I always make sure that I make appointments for the activities. And for weekly and, activ uh, weekly and daily activities, I will actually uh, use a planner. I use an hourly planner so I know exactly what I will be doing throughout my day. This way, my day is more predictable, it's less stressful, and I will never forget to self-care. So now you have seen how I implement my self-care routine. Why don't you try it out for yourself? Let me know in the comments below how you self-care. I really, really love to know. 
and in my next few videos i will share with you in detail on my morning routine and bedtime routine so if you are new to my channel do subscribe so you can get notified when my new videos drop in the meantime please stay safe stay home stay healthy and i'll see you in my next video bye